Hey guys, it's your girl Naturally Naughty here and today I have another wig video for you guys but today I'm going to be showing you a new wig product. This is the Wig Extensions Lace Tint Spray. It comes in three different shades. This stuff is so cool. It comes in mocha, golden, and beige and it takes your wig lace from looking like that to looking like this a lot more tinted and there are three different shades so there is a correct shade for you. This video is featuring clay the hair. I'm not going to be making a wig on camera but I'm going to be showing you the hair. It's very pretty and also I'm going to be using the lace from the closure from Clay Yee to tint using the wig extension spray. So if you're interested in seeing me do all that, you know what to do, just please stay tuned. So here we have the Clay Yee 7A Brazilian Deep Curly Hair. There are three bundles plus a closure in this little package. It comes with a 12 inch, a 14 inch, and a 16 inch bundle plus a 10 inch closure. This little bundle is exclusively sold on Amazon. This is Prime eligible, so if you are an Amazon Prime member like myself, you can get this hair in two days, and it is under $100. It's around $75, so it's very affordable. This is the closure. It comes with the middle part already in it, and as you can see, it's very nicely made. Okay, so this is the product I'm going to be showing you, and I'm going to be using it to tint the lace of the closure that I just showed you. This is the Wig Extensions Lace Tint Spray. It's the industry's first antibacterial lace tint spray, and it does come in three shades, which I think is amazing. The lightest one back there in the back is beige. The one right in the middle here is golden, and then the deepest shade is called mocha i really do like this because it seems like you could use it to match any skin tone because within the three shades you can customize the shade you can spray more to make it darker which i think is really really cool i'm going to be demonstrating all three shades for you guys on a paper towel so you can see how you can intensify the color just by spraying more of it so yeah i'm really excited i think these are really cool these are new to the market so i really think that these if you're a wig lover you really need to give these a try so we're going to start off with the deepest shade and it's called Mocha. I'm going to show you first, um, just with three sprays, the intensity of the color. And say we do five sprays next, as you can see, the color will get darker. And then on this last one, I'm going to do seven to eight sprays and you will see just how dark this can get. And that's what it looks like right here. The next shade is called Golden. So you do want to shake this spray very well before spraying. I just wanted to mention that. And once again, I'm going to do three sprays. Then I'm going to do five. And then lastly, I'm going to do about seven or eight. And as you can see, the more sprays that you give this stuff, the deeper that it will get. And I think that's very, very interesting and cool. So no matter your shade, you should be able to customize it to your skin tone so you can get your lace to match your skin. And then we have the lightest shade, which is beige. This shade right here is for, I would say, actually for Caucasian people, white people, because as you can see, when you spray it, especially with the three sprays, you can hardly see anything. This is for a very, very light skin person or a person that is white. Even with the eight shades, not too much color. But I like that because it's for everyone, like I said. So as you can see, a comparison of all three shades, we're starting from beige. Now we're moving to the middle shade, which is golden. And then lastly, on the last paper towel, I'm showing you Mocha, the deepest shade. And you can see just how deep this could get. Okay, so I'm all done with the wig that I made using the clay Yee hair. And now I have it turned inside out on my mannequin head so I can show you how I'm going to tint this lace. This is the paper towel that I sprayed the golden shade on. And we have the lightest, we have the medium, and then we have the deepest. I'm going to go somewhere between um, the medium and the deep. I did point to the medium there, but once I started spraying it, I wanted to go more for a deeper shade. So I am spraying a couple of sprays on it to start out. And then I'm trying to let it dry a little bit because you really should let this dry a little bit before you 
piled more and more on. It does actually say to use a hair dryer, and I think that actually would have worked better. I didn't know that until actually after I made this video to use a hair dryer to dry it. So if you do get this um, between applications, use a hair dryer to dry it down and then go in with more. But as you can see, it did work because after it dried, this is what it looked like. So there was a big difference between first starting out and then after letting it dry and this was the finished results. I could have went in with more and probably next time I will and I will use a hair dryer. So I have applied the wig to my head. I'm just going to show you real quick how I style the hair. Um, this is, you know, deep curly so it's a naturally curly type of texture. You do need to wet this hair every time that you wear it. Wet it uh, generously. So that's what I'm doing right here. And then I love taking a leave-in conditioner, a spray one preferably. Today I'm going to be using the Bio Silk Hydrating Therapy Leave-In Conditioner. This conditioner is amazing and it smells amazing. It will make the wig just smell really, really good. I do have clothes on by the way. And then using a mousse is another good product to have for naturally curly hair, um, human hair that you have. This is the Bio Silk Hydrating Therapy Mousse. And I'm just putting a lot of that throughout my hair. Ooh, hello, there's my husband right there in the background. But I'm putting a, gen a generous amount of that in my hands and I'm just gonna use that to scrunch up the curls to make the curls um, not crunchy, but you want them to be defined. So I'm using that to do that. And this is how it looks like when it's still wet and when it dries, it'll look even better. And as you can see, the hair is a really nice texture. It's really pretty. I wish it was longer, but I really enjoyed this hair and it's still going strong. I still have it um, right now and I have washed it and reworn it and it is very good quality hair, especially for the price. Very affordable. $75 for three bundles and a closure of 100% human hair is a great price. If you're interested in this hair or in the wig extensions lace tint spray, please check the description box below. And I really have nothing else to say other than that, but please subscribe before you go. And I cannot wait to hopefully see you in my next one. Bye.